any of us have faced this issue in the past you're done working on something and then you notice that you did not include one element to it and there's no room to include that element and or the position where you want to include the element is near impossible or you want to include an element in your design and you just want it not to follow the same flow or the same layout you just want it to be in a particular section of its own in that same layout i'm here to tell you that it's very easy for you to do and it's called absolute positioning absolute positioning basically allows you position whatever you're working on uh, or whatever element you want to position in your design such as this cancel icon over here you can see i have positioned it to the right and it just takes up that space now if i wanted to move it from here where it is to somewhere else i can do that easily without it breaking the layout now i'm going to show you how you can do this so the first step is to get out your design obviously you need a design here and now we have the cancel icon over here and we want to um, position this at the top right and we don't want to break this element we don't want to break the height the height of this is 405 so we want it to remain at 405 and we also want to add that element so basically all we have to do is grab that element and just move it into our design don't be scared move it into the design it's it this is auto layout so it's definitely going to be responsive and that's what has happened but now to fix this to have your absolute positioning is very easy so go to the top right select the item go to the top right and you're going to see this little icon here and it's called absolute positioning the one below is constraint proportions the one at the top is resize to fit just go to absolute position and click on it it breaks the layout back to what it was if i select this uh, frame you're going to see is 405 now we can take our element and it we're going to still have the grid that will tell us when to stop now you see the red line it's aligning both on top of the location icon and at the far right of our cta telling us is it's better at this position so i can either put leave it here or i can take it somewhere else i can bring it to the top uh, you know when you want to hang something at the top if i clip this it's going to be hidden so you have to unclip it just in case you're trying this out so unclip so that you can see it so you can position it there um, you can position it where we wanted to and that's it guys that's how you can position anything now imagine you want to do like an onboarding flow that shows like a radar reading at the top of this frame which is not a practical uh, example but you just want to add um, a rectangle let's say this is the rectangle and this is going to be green and then we just want it to be at the top right and we don't want to just start breaking our, our auto layout so all you have to do is simple select it go to your absolute position and it's here and then you can use the alignment tool to align uh top so just align top and align um left and that's it guys you can now clip this so that it shows uh this stuff and that's it you can do this for any element in your design and just keep things clean i'll see you guys very soon